the two by four. Bing bong bing bing bong bing bong. Your eyes are not deceiving you. Yes, we are playing a game from 2006, guys. Wow. When I tell you this is the best zombie game that has ever been created, no cap. I remember, I'm gonna turn this up for y'all real quick. I remember being in high school, okay? I was a paper boy. Why was I a paper boy? I wanted to save up money because the Xbox 360 was coming out. Look how cool that was to me. And one of the launch titles was, you guessed it, Dead Rising. Now, this isn't my first copy of the game. What? In fact, this isn't my second copy. This is like my third copy. This is like my fourth copy. I've bought this game probably six times. Ah, that's way. My videos are littered with Dead Rising references. And of course, I gotta represent. You know I look at that thing every day. A lot of people don't even know if you stay on this title screen without pressing a button, you get a cutscene. Enjoy, everybody. This is... Guys. Ooh, best zombie game, all right? Everybody let me know your favorite zombie game down in the chat because I know a lot of people gonna have different answers But this This one is mine. The story is <gasps> Mommy What was that noise? Mommy Shut up! What is it, sweetie? I Shut said, up! What was that noise? Nothing, sweetie. I just ran over a big frog. No, you didn't, Mommy. Frogs don't sound like that. Mommy, I'm bored. Yo. I want to open my eyes. You realize, like, please just be a good girl and keep your eyes closed like I told you. Okay, sweetie? This is like that remastered, obviously. Back when I played it, you know, back in my day, yeah, we was messing with polygons and triangles. What would you do in a zombie apocalypse? Where would you drive? Where's she even driving? like in every zombie game there's got to be a truck driver that just messes it up for everybody mommy i hit my head mommy mm, mm, mm. mommy mommy look look at the back window look look back there mommy wake up Get your Bob the Builder in the face looking. Bro, where did that zombie even go? I never knew that when I used to play this. Mommy! Oh, sweetie. Oh. Oh. Yep. Bro, see literally all they had to do. Look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Really? Zombies out here doing stuff like that? He's like, open that door up, girl. Yeah? I'm about to get in them guts. Now at this point, she knows that the car isn't gonna start up, right? What do you do? Get out and start running, right? 
No, if she's still trying to start it. Start! Start, dang it! Start, dang it! Look at this. Somebody come look at this. Why are you still trying to start the car? I got out! You coulda got out. Don't start screaming now. Nah. Before we start, I just wanted to play this today. I woke up and I was really tired. I didn't know what to play. And I thought, why not play my most favorite zombie game of all time? And really, one of my top games ever made. Now, the Dead Rising franchise, as a unit, I... I literally like the first one the best because it really started to get super silly kind of like what Saints Row did where it's like things just it just got too silly for me this first game it's just so I mean it's serious when it needs to be it's dark it's scary but with that being said we about to start this game I'm gonna just play it you know we don't gotta beat it this is, this is not a series or none you know I mean if y'all want it I literally beat this game a hundred times, so there will be zero surprise factor. Really, I'm just showing some of the youngins out there who don't know who Frank West the Gold is. This is Frank, though. I love this guy. Hey, buddy. This is first line. Say, buddy, yeah, you mentioned buddy. something about research for a story. That's right. Got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that, they sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Watch this face or yeah, animation. Well, freelance, pal. Watch. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> <laughs> so, Frank heard about a mall. Oh, I'm going to just let it, you know, I'm going to let the game. Here she is. <laughs> Willamette, Colorado. Population 53,594. Distinguishing characteristics. Jack sh <laughs> <laughs> About the only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. Now that was a foreshadowing. Um, right now, we're just going into town. Frank has heard that something is going on in this city so we paid a chopper to take him and uh what he found was a freaking zombie apocalypse and no this was not caused by umbrella this time so since frank west is a photojournalist oh look at this Whoa. what is that some kind of riot does it look like a riot my man is fighting for his life i'm fighting for my life bro see he could just jump Bro, don't look at me. Just jump off the back and run that way. Is this oh. what you came to take pictures of? Look, look at this. Got his leg. Oh, he's like, ah, get him. Oh, no, please. He still had a chance, dude. I'm telling you, if it was me, I would have did two front flips off the back and hit my Naruto run. And check that out. They got him. Look at all those people. What the hell's happening here? So you take these pictures, and the more that's happening in the pictures, the higher your score. Business as usual in this town. Just imagine the fear those children must feel. You look at the gas station, right? Uh huh. Watch, watch it, watch it. Right there. I get it perfect every time, guys. All right, guys, this is my personal favorite. Look at this. So we got a woman on a rooftop. How does she get there? We don't know. She's surrounded by zombies, okay? Even though there are big gaps in between them, she could have ran that way. But maybe it's just because she's not the ankle breaker like I am. So then she backs up. She actually has a gun. Just getting body shots like she doesn't know how to kill zombies. Throws the gun. 
like a freaking moron and it's like, hey you! I see you! Look at that. Ah! That zombie's freaking idiot. And then grab. You get that picture right there? So this is the mall. A zombie game in a mall. Like, it's perfect! <sighs> hey! Dawn of the can you get me on the rooftop of that mall? You gotta be kidding me! You gotta be kidding Man, me! You are nuts. Alright, listen! Don't forget to come back for me! As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. It's Frank. Frank West. West. Remember, Remember that, that name, name. the whole world's gonna know it in three, three days. days. Look, I, I, I knew this without the subtitles, alright? I never know what was in there. They're almost like the military. Get They're like, down to this is a no-fly zone. No, I'm gonna get my butt chewed out for this one. <laughs> it's booty ate like grocery? Yo, them anchors would have been shattered. So he gets dropped off. Huh? You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. No. You came alone. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, go on the battlefield alone. No, no crew. crew. So, uh, what's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? Mm hmm What did you see from the sky? Yo, back up! Well... Freaking walking up on me. If it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. Facts. The moratorium on information getting out is a little... extreme, in my opinion. Okay. There's, uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. Mm. <laughs> Almost as if everyone's already dead. The helicopter guy said he's coming back in three days. Now time is always moving in this game. So we could actually just stand here for three days and then win the game. But then where's the fun in that? So we go in the mall and uh, that's where everything's really popping off. Guys, y'all don't even understand how many references that I have because of this man. Every time I'm like, yeah, it's because of him. When he eats something, he's like, yeah. It's, I don't know, man, this is cool. Uh-oh, security cameras. Another sucker game body. What are you doing? Just run. Now you're getting handled. Look, man, all that meat to waste. What in the world? I don't care what people say about my man's Frank nose. I think this guy has a nice dis distinguished face. I mean, who here really is like that out here? Frank, man, he showed everybody that you don't gotta be Link cute to be a protagonist. Uh-oh. We're in the lobby. Other survivors. Let's get it. Bring that over here. Why was he just standing there? Madonna. Oh, Quit screwing oh. around. Oh, oh. oh. Dang. see my baby. I can't live without my precious little sweetie doggy. Oh, where is my Madonna? Where is she? Oh, oh. Madonna. Bro, what is up with... Oh, what? Oh. Oh. Hey, this is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. 
You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? Bro, why are your eyes so big? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. Man, this dude's using. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? Man has a point. Oh, oh, look at that one. There's been more and more of them since last night. Now. They're all that's out there. Look at this man's eyes. <laughs> hey, look on the bright side. Zombies are stupid and slow. We should be safe in here. All right then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. Bro, I just got. I didn't say I was doing anything. Man, I came for the food. All right, so we get to walk around. We get to see everybody building a barricade. Matter of fact, this is a photo op. Photo op. Fantastic, buddy. Okay, so we got this girl, Lindsay. Dude, such a freaking mouthful. Up. She, this girl, Lindsay, is looking for her dog. We got these guys doing the barricade, which sucks. Is all it is glass, but. They're holding back for now. Then we got girls over here. Just kind of scared. Bro, just imagine. You trapped in a mall with a bunch of strangers. And this is zombies. Alright, so this stuff can help with the barricade. Huh? Uh. You! Stop right there! Do you have any idea what you've done? Why? Why did you summon me to this place? What are you planning? Would you calm down? I don't even know what you're talking about. Let him know! Huh? Frank wasn't taking no jump from huh? nobody. Huh? You calm down? I don't know what you're talking about. What the? You know? That's sometimes you just gotta... Uh oh. Is she throwing these grown men out? She is an old woman! She's unlocking the door! Bro, push her in there! Oh my! Oh my! This old woman! Every time I watch that, it's, it's just painful. What in the hell are you people doing? Look at the back of his move. head. Get over here. It's ashy. Look. Everyone, move this way. <laughs> Why the heck? Why your head ashy, bro? So because of Lindsay, because this old, decrepit freaking woman saw her dog outside, she let all the zombies in. Now, I'm going to show y'all why this is the best zombie game ever made. Literally, you could pick up anything and use it as a weapon. The freak back. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me throw this. Throw it, throw it. The freak back. Guys. Guys. Do you know, do you understand how... This is the kind of game that I... When I was little, and I said I wanted to design video games. This is probably the closest to what I wanted to do. And how many games can you not only pick up pretty much every object, but store it in an inventory and throw it it's such a simple concept executed perfect oh my gosh just look back. this is just stuff you would do in real life you would just pick stuff up and just throw it then we get a two by four bing bong bing bing bong bing bong bong bing up oh, then you get bit okay and then you bing bong bing bong you know bing bong you know, and then you just pick up a knife. Then you just start samurai slicing, like y'all said do on that like button. Matter of fact, I can pause it. Give you a second. Yeah, like button. Yeah, appreciate you. Like Verlene, what do you? Why are you standing here, Verlene? All right, I'm sorry. I gotta leave. Go oh, run, jump. See bag of chips, right? You're like what? There's a bag of chips, bro. Look at this. You eat and get your health back. Ah! Hold up, get your angles, broke boy. Jump, 
up. I told y'all, Berlin. And every time a survivor dies, it tells you. And depending on, um, look at this. For a freaking dog, all right? I love dogs as much as the next man. But come on. Huh? Y'all see her? Where are the others? Your head ashy. That's all I got. <laughs> I don't know. I hope they got away. That's the first thing I would have said to him. <laughs> this dude, like, yup. We sealing this. Oh. As long as those things are in the mall. We better not use this door. Uh, what are you doing? Looking for some jerkins for my head. The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. Wait a minute. You want to get back in there? What for? Hey, you left me alone, though. Nice camera. Are you a photographer? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I am. That's what that means. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures, Frank? <laughs> How's she just going to curve him like that? Okay, okay. All right, guys. I'm gonna. You really seem to know what you're doing. <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> Who are you guys, anyway? Notice. And what are you? Hold up. Yeah. I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something. Hmm. She thinks he's important. No. Nope. Thanks for showing me, though. Yeah, you're freaking lying. Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Assertive. I like a man that's assertive. Just pause! Who are you guys? Hey, we ain't done talking. I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. Jesse. All right. Well, Jesse. You're thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. So that said, time until the helicopter comes. 71 hours. Oh, they going by real time. Real game time, not real life time. I think each minute in the game is like a... Two seconds? Three seconds, four seconds. Five seconds. About five seconds. So we're gonna end it there, guys. Um, I just wanted to show you pretty much the beginning. You eat to... Look, look. Frank, can you give me a yeah for the people? You know what? I think he does it after you eat the bread. I remember after you eat the bread, he's like, yeah. Or when you level up. Matter of fact, let's try to level up real quick. I really want you guys to hear the yeah. So because uh, our friend Otis here, let's get a one for the gram. Because he welded the door shut, uh, we're gonna use the rooftop to go out now. This game came out in 2006, bro. That's uh, that's all I gotta say. Hey, anybody around? Hey, anybody around? I mean, it was solid voice acting. The gameplay is literally 10 out of 10. Hey, brother. What's going on, man? What's up? You, have you seen my wife, Natalie? She should be around here. Looking for someone? I'll lend a hand. That'd be great, fella. The name's Jeff Meyer, by the way. I'm Frank. I'm a journalist. But, like, he didn't need to know all that, but alright. 50% of the game is uncovering why there's a zombie apocalypse going on. Yeah. And then the other 50% is actually finding survivors and bringing them back to the safe room via that vent shaft over there. Now, I also happen to know that Natalie was just Mr. over here. And he could have literally walked over here and found his wife. But sometimes there are special moments that happen. And if you catch him on camera. Hold on. 
<sighs> Fantastic. Yeah, you get a lot of points for it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, how old was I in 2006? 14 years old, guys. Oh, and every all right. Oh yeah, when when you level up, they they feel like, you know, it's a celebration as well. When I was 14, every time I heard that, yeah, I'd be like, we did that, man. So, because they're in my party now, they follow me. If you press the Y button, follow me. Come on. It like sometimes they'll be grabbed up by zombies. Follow me! If you do a Y, like, follow me! They'll, like, snap out of it, and then they'll come to you. And then you can also, go, like, send them places. But we're going in here. I ain't never going to the mall again as long as I live. I've had about enough of this. Yeah. Escort complete. Give me my points. Yeah. yeah. Uh. So we gotta stock up. See, it's like a RPG, dude. You leveling up. You, it's like the perfect game, dude. And then once you save people, you can f now find them in here in the safe Thank room. Thank you so much. Thanks. No problem, guys. I mean, you guys were literally on the roof, and you save it by uh, actually just going to sleep. I just don't like how they be crying in here. But all right, you guys. Um, if you do want to see another episode, I mean, there's so much more I can show you. I just wanted to share with you guys it's where i get a lot of the music that i use for my channel oh yeah this one this game has such good music a lot of my references music just it all came from here so thank you capcom you continue to be one of my most favorite game development studios thank you xbox 360 for giving me a great childhood and thank you guys for slicing that like button so hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you're this is Samurai, slice that like button. Subscribe today to join us, Samurai. Let me know if you want a part two. And until next time, my brothers and sisters. Lovely, 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 lovely.